The very first thing that you should do is spend a disproportionate amount of time in understanding, genuinely understanding what your CEO, your manager, your CFO wants to actually take a look at in the report. Let's just say that you're trying to compare current year versus last year sales. And if the sales are down, you should have the answer to what the CEO or the CFO is going to take a look at next. And then what after that? And then what after that? How is the CEO or the CFO or your manager is going to arrive at a solution to the problem by looking at the data? And if you do understand that chain of thought from the starting till the end, you'll be able to put together a brilliant report. The second most important skill is the accuracy of the numbers. If the numbers that you're presenting to your people, your manager are incorrect in the first place and they're not accurate, they can't be trusted, then you'd not be able to put together a brilliant report. The final thing is the presentation of the data and it matters a lot more than what you think. Now, I'm not asking you to create a dashboard that has to compete in a beauty pageant, but your dashboard should be presentable enough that it's professional, it's clean, well aligned, and it actually shows the numbers that the person was seeking to find in the first place. By the way, in Goodly Insider, I teach to solve very hard problems using Power BI. In case you're interested, the Black Friday sale is going on. See you inside, cheers.